Oh, are you ready to go? Yep, I guess we're ready to go. From now on, we're fugitives. I'm sure that this will be a dangerous journey. I don't want to get our team involved. Our team members involved in this. Must not tell them. We should go by ourselves. We have to run from the rescue team stalking us. We have to keep running because we can't afford to be caught. Yes, we have to escape. Like Alakazan Al said that time yesterday. Against all odds, you must run. Run, run, and survive. You must run and run until you cover the truth. Yes. Who am I? Until I discover the truth, I have to run and survive. Even if it means going to the edge of this world. Okay. Let's get going. Zeno! Caterpie, Metapod, and Metapod too. Oh, and even Jumpluff. Well, I'm glad we made it. We want to see you all, Zeno. Me too. Good morning, it's me, Diglett. I wanted to send you off too. Everyone. It's a letter. Zeno, can you read it? Zeno began reading the letter. Take care. It's farewell, but only for now. Till the day I can deliver mail to you again, I will always be waiting. The wandering postal carrier, Pelipper. Even Pelipper. <laughs> Everyone, thank you. The other Pokemon will be waking soon. You have to hurry. You have to go. Hurry. Yep. Zeno? Let's go. Hit the road. Take care. We'll be waiting for both of you to return. Yep. Thank you. We'll be back. That's for certain. Until then, take care. Thus began Zeno's cruel and arduous journey as a fugitive. Over forbidding mountains. Whoa! Aren't these fishers amazing? Across fields of fire. The, the environment is out of control here too. The forest fire is still raging. But through it all, Zeno's team Kept their heads held high. Without a complaint, they marched on. Whew. We've sure traveled a long way. But while we while we were moving, I couldn't help thinking all sorts of places have been affected by the natural disasters. I'm sure many Pokemon are suffering because of the calamities. I wish we could get back to doing our rescue work. Sorry, I shouldn't complain, 
We have to get away now. Period. Huh? I hear voices. I figured it went this way. But can't get away. Not from all of us. We have to find Zeno quickly. Oh no! Are they catching up to us? Zeno, we better go. Hey everyone, Zeno and Zimmy here, and welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Last time, well, there's not really been a last time. But now, we're journeying into a new dungeon. From here on, from here on, we will not be able to recruit Pokemon until eventually we return to our rescue work. What we'll focus on trying to escape? However, we want to make sure we at least get money and items to at least prepare us for what could be ahead. Just trying to think of what time because I don't want to talk about what I, what my mind is immediately going to first because I think I might leave that for the next dungeon. Oh, sparkle pot, spot. We want to try and use as much items as we can for any better items. Our goal here is to survive. However, as you notice, there's a cackling on shop here. So first of all, let's try and get rid of you. Yep, yeah, cackling seems fine. Doing doing business with us. Ah, uh, we will want that. You want to try and get as many, many Tyranny Viruses as you can. Link Boxes! Expensive, but really useful. We will not be buying this because I'm not wanting to get chased. I remember these being cheaper in the original game. I don't think they were that much cheaper, but I definitely don't remember them being that expensive. But that doesn't matter. We need to get away, so we're going to try and make sure that we do. And as long as we're not stealing, Kecleon won't care. Even though we've been branded as a fugitive, he'll still sell, sell to us. Uh, I literally do not know what to talk about because I don't want to talk about what I'm wanting to talk about. What my mind wants to talk about. I guess I could talk about how the story is right now, because oh, as a kid, oh my god, was this just, this is a heavy thing just to hit a kid with. You've got to be joking. Like, suddenly having to be on the run for your life? Like, Jesus. But then again, that's why BMD games are so beloved, because they're, they're, don't, they don't really shy away from... from dark stuff. And are willing to hit you right in the gut. The one thing I kind of wish... This game did though. 
Oh, that's... Okay, this is actually a really good bandana. But not on us. We want to bring that along. But not for us. We want to do it for something and some... Something else. However, I guess, actually, no, I know what I can talk about. We want to at least become, become at least decently powerful. Well, mainly because unlike Only before where we've at least prepared for anything, we don't know when we're going to get a boss. Well, I do, and if you've played the games before, you probably can tell when as well. Also, new thing on, from this game, if you get to zero PP, link moves don't break. I kind of like this, but I also don't. I wish it did break. Because, oh my god, we're getting really good items from these, Jesus. I wish it did break, and for one simple reason. One very simple reason. Because it would make you have to be try and be resourceful. Yeah, it was annoying when we first had that happen. Happen to us. To us. But that's kind of the point of them. There may be risk versus reward. We've made a very powerful move move or combination of moves linked together and now you're having to rely on just what is l trying to rely on what I can't speak for some reason why I can't speak. You have to rely on what is with my brain today? You have to rely on, on just knowing when to just not use it. Plus, it means that you have to try and bounce out items. Uh, yeah, but razor, razor leaf's kind of better in every way. So no, I'm not keeping, I'm not keeping magical leaf. Cause poison powder still has some use. Grant, I probably should start. I should have probably linked uh, poison powder with another move. Now that I think about it. Oh well. However, you also... Also, if you do faint, you will appear right in front of the cave. It's something kind of cool that they did, that they didn't have to. They could have just had you just reset again. But it's nice that they didn't. And if you go back in, there is another dungeon you can go in, but Lapis Cave is what you need to go through. Unlike Sir Chugga Conroy, I don't know why I said Sir. He's he's not knighted. I don't know why. Ignore my weir weird ways. Unlike Chugga Conroy, I am only doing showing the correct path, the correct dungeon to go through. Because you can't return to these old dungeons, and even then they don't. I don't believe they gave much of anything. All these scarves. Okay, I'm going to eat an apple. Really?
For a moment there, I actually thought that was a that was a crowbar. I was like, I don't remember there being crowbars in this goddamn dungeon. Excuse me, Arceus damn dungeon, damned dungeon. If you want to try and grind, not only not only items but also moves here. You can also do that, just be careful to not stay too long. Why are we getting gold ribbons? I've never had this many gold ribbons appear. No, we're going this way. And this is why I don't like oh much half the time now. Now I remember why. I think we're nearly out, so I, so I think I'm surprised. I'm, I'm surprised I managed to actually come up with something, but I think I might have been able to. Oh, link box. Yeah, I'm going to actually use an ivory because link. I want to link poison powder and ancient power. Too bad we can't link razor leaf with it because honestly, she needs that on its own, and solar beam. Solar beam, I'm gonna probably eventually get rid of. It's nice. Yes, because ivory's not gonna to be too useful. We're still not out. Quite sure we're close to the end though. There's not much to talk about because I don't want to talk about what I want to talk about until the next dungeon. Because I don't have anything to, I don't have anything to talk about the next dungeon about. This this dungeon I didn't have anything either. But I I thought I would have thought of like something. Because at least with the other dungeon. At least the other, the other dungeon. That dungeon's long. This dungeon isn't. I didn't think I would take Did she really just... <sighs> There's something I will never ever say is good. The AI Mystery Dungeon does not know sometimes when using a weak move is better. Thank God. Whew. Finally, we made it through that cave. Where's the Pokemon mod that was after us? Mo mod? <laughs> Mob. <laughs> Hey Luke, there we are, over there! Catch Zeno! Whoa, here they come! Run! Stop right there! Don't let them get away! They expect us to stop and wait for them? Oh no, look! It's a mountain of fire. It's Mount Blaze. Look at all that lava pouring from the crater. I feel really bad for Ivory. Because we're going into a lava dungeon next. Can we even make it through there? I can. Don't know about you, Ivory. But for catching up to us. What will we do, Zeno? Look, there we are. Get him. There's no choice now. Let's go, Zeno. Look at him go. We're running for Mount Blaze. Are they insane? Mount Blaze is doomed desolation. No one's ever come this far before. I don't want to go anywhere, anywhere like that. Can't be helped. Only those brave enough will give it the, will give it the chase. Darn it. Where do they go? They had to go this way. Keep your eyes open.
I think they're gone. I don't know why your character is the one to do this. Ivory makes more sense. Whew. I think we managed to evade them. But there isn't any point in hiding here. We have to get over this mountain to get away. Let's get ready as soon as... Let's get... Let's go as soon as we're ready, Zeno. May I just say, before we end off the episode, I love the look of this area. But also, before we... Before I end... End off. That scene... At the end of the dungeon. Changes depending on what partner you have. I don't know if they've done this for this game. For this... For the remake. But in the original game, depending on what your your, your partner's personality type, it would change. I really like some of the some of them because they're really nice touches, and some of them are actually really good for, for that really good and can crack you up honestly. Just making fun of how they're just saying, telling you to stop right there. Don't remember the actual dialogue off by heart though. But, excuse me. Excuse me again, sorry. I do not know what's, I don't know why I'm so gassy today. <laughs> uh, get rid of a few apples, I guess, as much as I don't want to. Let's get, let's keep one more apple. But with that, and that's the items we're bringing, next time on Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX, we will be scaling Mount Blaze. You can probably tell what something will be waiting for us at the top. This is Zeno and Azuma, the Fugitive. Signing out.